Assalamualaikum and very good day to all. The video that I produced this time is an introduction to a type of herbal tree that is popular in Malaysia due to the nutrients it has. This herbs is called kratom. According to reliable sources, United States is also currently conducting studies on this herbs benefits. Kratom is being said to be quite popular in the U.S. because of its effectiveness as an antibody and cancer cure, according to the research. Today, I would like to share the pros and cons of Kratom, depending on how it's being used. Among the benefits of kratom's leaves are It can be used as a cure for problems in the stomach, constipation, and angina problems. The second is to boost the body's immune system. The third, to increase the strength of the body, usually used by people with diabetes. But, you need to put in mind, Kratom can also lead to negative effects as well. It is as a result of its use. Number one, Kratom leaves can be addictive to the practitioner. Second, it can thicken the blood and give problems to the heart as well as high blood pressure. Third, it says that kratom can damage your kidneys. All these things can happen if these herbs is taken continuously without any controls. The thing that you need to know is with all the benefits and with all the pros and cons, the kratom herbs is easy to plant, even with an uprooted seedling that grows on its own. It is not difficult to plant and grow your own kratom herbs in your garden. Simple and fascinating facts about kratom. I will elaborate more on how to grow this kind of herbs in my next video. Last but not least, majulah sukan untuk negara. Please subscribe to my channel. For